hello friends welcome back to node.js tutorial in this video we are going to discuss about how to use delete api with node.js right so in our previous video we are going to discuss about the api tutorial series with the node.js and express with the mysql database right so already discussed about how we can use the get api how to use the post api and how to update data or put api and in this video uh, we are going to discuss how to create a delete api so we are using express.js and we are using the json formatted data for api and for testing purpose we are using the postman right and we created uh, this routing with express and here i just going to create another routing that is app dot delete so we'll uh, so we're going to learn about the delete api and obviously it will take re uh, request and response and obviously this is a callback function right and here we need to use the delete operation right so just like update if you want to delete something we need to pass the proper id which i need to delete right so simply just pass the id here and we will pass the id from the postman also so just go here and suppose i want to uh, delete uh, the record 8 we just pass in this and this time the method will be the delete right and let's build the logic so simply just uh, write the query first and connection dot query and here we need to use the delete query so simply write delete from the table name that is students okay and where is the error actually we need to start with a semicolon so simply write not semicolon let's say invite comma delete from students where id equal to the student id so how it will get the student id so let's close this so let's check whether we are getting this id from the route or not so let's check how we can get so simply write console dot log and we are getting the id from the request so simply write request dot params dot id right and let's hit this and see whether we are getting or not so there is eight okay now if i just want to change or if i just are going to uh, request through the another id that is three and let's see so just put the terminal we are getting three. that means id are getting from the route section okay so now now we need to write the query so i'm taking this id with a, another variable so simply write let id sorry here write let student id equal to request.parameter.id and i need to pass that things from here so just write in this way and not here actually we need to pass with this right so by using plus we can concatenate and the thing is this is the query and we will pass the second parameter as a um, closer function that is the array sorry that is the error and result right and inside here just create another arrow function and just like previous just copy here okay so if anything error found in uh, this uh, in this route it will throw the error otherwise uh, its response uh, is not it will not throw error actually uh, simply to throw the error we can write throw error that means it will throw the error simply if I just write here all places it will be good okay so basically if I just to send that means it will only say the error but not getting the proper error message so simply write error okay so these are good now to delete so all things are done now just go to the postman and i want to delete the id from three and let's check in the three there is amal amal at the red email.com so click on send and affected rows one and 200 okay so just go to the 
browser again and let's check three is deleted or not yes three deleted now i need to delete uh, suppose i want to delete eight and click on send it's also deleted so just go to database and refresh deleted so this is very easy and uh, this is the delete api of node.js using express framework with the help of mysql hope you will like this video still if you have any queries about this video with a full api tutorial please comment in a below comment section so in our upcoming video we are going to learn about some authentication with node.js so how we can uh, create a login logout or how we can use the token to validate any user right so we'll go in some advanced topic with a node application right so please like and subscribe this channel and i will recommend you please see the full tutorial from the beginning and that will help for the upcoming video thanks for watching this video have a good day